This video is instruction on two octave major scales for viola. Now I'm assuming that at this point you've done the one octave major scales and the beauty of the two octaves is the one octaves remain exactly as you just learned them. So now we're tacking on the second octave. We're going to use the same approach. We're going to start all major scales with first finger except the open string scales and this instruction also corresponds with the worksheet that I've provided for you so hopefully that will make some sense as well. Now when we do one octave major scales that start on first finger we're going to uh, for a bunch of the scales for the D flat major scale, the D major scale, E flat, E, F, and F sharp. And for each of these scales, we're going to play the 3-4 finger pattern on the C string, the 3-4 finger pattern on the G string, the 2-3 finger pattern on the D string, and the 2-3 finger pattern on the A string. So again, if we just remember those patterns going across the strings, we're going to be successful with the two octave major scales. Let's go ahead and play each of the two octave major scales that begin with a first finger on the C string. So this is starting with D flat. Two octave C major scale obviously starts on the open C string. We'll play the 2 3 finger pattern on the C string, the 2 3 pattern on the G, the 1 2 on the D string, and the 1 2 pattern on the A string. Now, the G major scale is very similar to the C major scale. It starts on an open string, and the first two open strings, the G and the D, use the 2-3 finger pattern. When we get over to the A string, we'll use the 1-2 finger pattern, and then we have to do one shift 
to third position. And we go to third position, and the last two notes of the scale, third and fourth finger, are our half step. So it's a shift, and we do a 3-4 pattern at the end. Okay? You'll see this as we go. This is the G major scale, starting on open G. Now, the last set of major scales, two octave major scales, start with first finger on the G string. And they, of course, are A flat, A, B flat, and B. And they're all, they all use the same finger patterns. They're also very similar to the fingered scales that we had starting on the C string, but they involve a shift. So, on the G string, we play the 3-4 finger pattern. On the D string, we play the 3-4 finger pattern. On the A string, it would be the 2-3 finger pattern, but we're going to shift after second finger up to first finger and then play first, second, third, fourth, and then extend your fourth a half step for the final half step of the scale. So we will always do one shift on the A string and a little extension at the end. And I think you'll see this very quickly, and that fingering is uh, written down on the worksheet as well. Here's the A flat major scale, two octaves. <laughs> 